Hey guys and welcome to another video. So I'm in Nottingham right now and I'm gonna show you around all the places I normally go to when I'm in Nottingham. So I'm currently walking into Victoria shopping centre, show you around. I'm in Victoria's shopping centre and that's in the centre of Nottingham and I'm just walking towards the food court. I don't think there's a lot of things in the food court to be honest, there's like two or three restaurants um, but I'll show you anyway. Um, there's more downstairs like McDonald's, Tortilla, Subway, I'll just show you in a sec. This is the upstairs food court, um, there is Johnny Rocket, I think that's what it's called. Yeah, I think it's Johnny Rocket. I'll show you. There's really not a lot in this food court, in the food court upstairs. There's downstairs, there's, more, there's like McDonald's and tortilla, like I said. But yeah, the rest of this place is just shops like River Island, WH Smith, John Lewis. John Lewis is really big, there's like three or four stories um, with electronics, um, makeup, clothes, and like cutlery and stuff like that. Inside Victoria Centre, there's also the Victoria Centre Market, which are like small sh independent shops by, let me show you, Victoria Centre Market. Um, there's like tailors, and it's there if you want to it support independent shops, like small independent shops. Okay, I'm going to show you the downstairs part now. thought I'd show you inside Victoria Centre. It's obviously not everything. There's a Tesco in there um, that you can go grocery shopping if you live nearby. It's like the centre of Nottingham is very student central. Like it's, um, it's mainly focused towards students from what I've noticed because there's obviously NTU, Nottingham Trent University, and it's in the centre. I'm going to show you the corner house now as well as the little, the road leading up to the corner house. Um, the corner house has like mini golf, um, cinema world, subway and like some bar things. Along the road that's leading up to the corner house there's like Nando's, Wingstop, a boba, a boba shop and yeah I'll just take you along that road now. Okay so I've just reached the road leading up to the corner house. Um, it's only literally like a three minute walk from Victoria Centre. In fact, that is the building for Victoria Centre right behind me. <laughs> I just went out a different exit from the one that's behind me, the John Lewis exit. But anyway, long story made short, this road full of restaurants and stuff. Um, yeah, I'll, ta I'll, sp I'll span you around now. Yeah, just behind me is the corner house and in there there's just like a cinema um mini golf like i said subway and some bars in there um yeah i frequent there a lot so i thought i'd show you and just around just next to it really there's a tgi fridays and a wagamama just next to it um and now i'm just going to show you basically the center of Nottingham. It's like this really pretty building. I'm not entirely sure what it is. I literally just moved there a couple of months ago. That's the building right there. I mean, if you're into nightlife, the nightlife in Nottingham is really vibrant. Um, like, I don't know what days are the most popular days or what days are student nights. Obviously, I'm not a student anymore. I graduated last year <laughs> um, from Swansea, in fact. Like, I, obviously, I don't know anything about Nottingham. But I do know, like, the centre of Nottingham quite well now. I come here quite often. Um, I'm just showing you where, where I frequent the most. Um, I usually go to 
Victoria Center, the bowling alley or the corner house. So that's what I'm showing you now. It just gives you like an idea of what Nottingham's like and what you can do here. Um, everyone here is really friendly, like um, the cafes are really nice. I'll show you the nice building in the center. It's really hard to miss, to be honest. When I came to visit my friend Holly in Nottingham like last year or two years ago, I can't remember. No, it was two years ago now. Um, this is where she took me and it's literally the center of Nottingham. So it's hard, to fu it's hard to miss to be honest. And yeah, there's just shops all around here. This is, th this is where the, the livelihood of the city comes from basically. Okay, so moving on, there's a Primark here and I'll take you inside the nice fancy building because there's lights in there and it's very picturesque. So basically I just found out that the pretty building is called the Exchange. Um, this is what it looks like from the inside. Yeah, it is very pretty in here. Um, like. There's a Dunkin' Donuts. I mean, there's nothing really to do inside the building other than these shops. I'm gonna take you to the bowling alley now. Um, that is big. I think it's like the biggest bowling alley in the, has the most bowling alley, like lanes in the UK or something like that. And it's next to Motor Point Arena. Um, and that's where all the concerts happen, where the large concerts happen in Nottingham. <laughs> Like I was saying about clubs and stuff like that, there's loads around like centre. There's loads of pubs and clubs. So all you have to do is just go along all the all the side streets and find all these clubs. I just don't go clubbing to be honest. So I don't know any of them, but it's a nice light night life here. I'm still walking towards the bowling alley. It's a 10 minute walk maybe from the center um, where that fancy building was called the exchange that I just found out today. <laughs> that last clip was of the bowling alley that I usually frequent. Um, yeah, like it says it has 48 lanes. Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, it's really nice and clean. So definitely worth going to if, you, if you're looking for something to do in Nottingham. And then next to it, I just want to quickly show you the Motor Point Arena where all the major concerts happen in Nottingham. I haven't been inside yet because, I, like I said, I've only been here since September. But this is the Motor Point Arena. And it's next to Nottingham Bowl. That's all the spots I wanted to show you guys today. Um, it's quite a short video, I'm guessing, when I edit it. But I just wanted to give you all the spots that are worth going to, like the Victoria Center, the corner house, this bowling place, and the Motor Point Arena. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.